boys and girls welcome I am Tamika Wilson and today we're doing English language for grade 10 in today's lesson we are going to be doing sentence completion but this time we will be using synonyms what are synonyms of course it's a noun the two words that can be interchanged in a context are said to be synonymous relative to that context Today we're looking at sentence completion using synonyms and here we are selecting a word from the options 8D that is nearest in meaning to the word in color in each sentence. Let's begin. 1. Bobby's contribution to the debate revealed a superficial interpretation of the issue. We want to make sure we understand the word superficial as well as the options that we're given so that we are able to adequately select the nearest in meaning to the word superficial. Superficial, it's an adjective that means concerning with or comprehending only what is apparent or obvious, not deep or penetrating emotionally or intellectually. Our options are A, surface, which is a noun, the out, outer boundary of an artifact or material layer constituting or resembling such a boundary. Simple, it's an adjective, having a few parts, not complex or complicated or involved. Or it can also be a noun, which is a person lacking intelligence or common sense. Trivial is an adjective, small or of little importance. And D, shallow, which is an adjective, not deep or strong, not affecting one deeply. So our word is what? Superficial. So from the options given, what do you think is the nearest in meaning to the word superficial? That's correct. Now we cannot use surface, simple or trivial. And so the answer is, of course, shallow, because when we look at the definition, it says not deep or strong, not affecting one deeply. Number two, Rihanna was a reserved person, but she could become quite animated on certain topics. Our word for consideration is Animated, our options are A, lively, B, aggressive, C, vital, and D, agitated. Again, we want to make sure we understand the definition of the words so that we can select the word that is nearest in meaning to the word animated. Animated is an adjective meaning having life or vigor or spirit. Lively, A, option A, is an adjective which means full of life and energy. Aggressive means having or showing determination and energetic pursuit of your ends. Vital is an adjective which means urgently needed, absolutely necessary. Agitated adjective means troubled emotionally and usually deep. Now, again, which from the options A to D do you think is the nearest in meaning to the word animated? That's correct, lively, option A. Because remember, we said Animated means having life or vigor or spirit. And when we look at the definition for lively, it says full of energy, um, full of life. So that's correct. Sentence three, 
Michael was admonished by Father because of the aggressive way he spoke to people. Our word for consideration is admonished. Our options are A, warned, B, chastised, C, advised, and D, corrected. Admonish is a verb which means advise or counsel in terms of someone's behavior. Our options are A, warned, which means advise or counsel in terms of what someone's behavior. B, chastised, which means admonished in strong language. C, advise, which is a verb, give advice to inform somebody of something. And D, correct, which is an adjective, having something undesirable neutralized. From our options, we will know that the nearest in meaning would be what? That's correct, warned, because warned says advise or counsel in terms of someone's behavior. And that is exactly what admonish, admonished means, advise or counsel in terms of one's behavior. Four, at the conference, researchers shared novel ideas on many current problems. Our word for consideration is novel. Our options are A, exciting, B, interesting, C, original, V, creative. Again, we want to look at the meaning of the word so that we can select the word that is nearest in meaning to the word novel. Novel is an adjective which, is, which means original and of a kind not seen before. Our options are exciting, which is an adjective creating or arousing excitement. Interesting, an adjective arousing or holding attention. Original, adjective being or productive of something fresh and unusual or being as first made or thought of. Creative, the adjective having the ability or power to create. So from our options, which of the word is closest or nearest in meaning to the word novel? That is correct. Option C, original, being of productive of something fresh and unusual or being as made first of or thought of. And finally, our parents unsuccessfully tried to dissuade my brother from active involvement in sports. Our word for consideration is dissuade. Our options are A, stop, B, prevent, C, discourage, or D, influence. Let's look at the word dissuade. It's a verb which means to turn away by persuasion. Our options are A, stop, which is a verb meaning come to halt, stop moving. Prevent uh, is a verb, option B keep from happening or arising, making impossible. Discourage, which is option C, is a verb which means to prevent, show opposition to. And the influence is also a verb having or exert influence or effect. So from our options A to D, which of the word is nearest in meaning to the word dissuade? That's correct. C, discourage, try to prevent or show opposition. Two, that's all for today. Thank you. And remember to be good students and I will see you next time.